Hello, I'm using a Studio Press theme called Lifestyle Pro and I want to set it up the way that it looks on this Studio Press site, on the demo site. So the easiest way to find out how to do it is to Google Studio Press theme setup and then the name of your theme. I'm using Lifestyle Pro so that's what I'm searching for and when I search for that I see this list and it's mystudiopress.com setup and then different themes. So this is Lifestyle and it shows you all the instructions. Now if you scroll down it tells you exactly what to do. Now there's uh, configure the home page. But this theme uses uh, blog posts, it displays blog posts here and I want to use pay web pages because I don't have any blog posts on my site yet. So what I do, I've gone to my Genesis dashboard, I'm looking at pages. Now I need enough pages, each page, each sort of chunk that's one page, that's another page, that's another page and these are more pages. So I need enough pages to actually fill all the boxes. I'm going to use four boxes so I need four pages. So I've got one, two, three, four. We're okay. <coughs> Pardon me. So now what I need to do, I need to go to Appearance, Widgets and I drag a widget into a widget area and the, that makes these things appear. So, and there's, there's the home page widgets, which are what we're going to use as home top, home middle, home bottom left, and home bottom right. Now, I've set up all the others, I just need to set up the home top one. So, I need a Genesis featured page widget, and I drag it into home top. Now, I have to set it up. Now, I've made some slides for you. So, this is the settings for the way I've set it up on my site. I've got home top, home middle, home bottom, left and right. So in the home top one, I'm going to show the featured image, I'm going to choose a services page, and have a big, big image, that 634 size image. So I've dragged the featured page widget into home top widget area, choosing the services page for that one show a featured image, I want a big image size which is home large I'm choosing I'm not going to align it, I want it to be in the middle of the page show the title, show content of 360 characters and I'm going to type for more text, just read more now if we save that and we go to our front page, at the moment we've just got three boxes there I've added another one, it's the big box at the top I've added there it is, there's a big picture, big featured image and a bit of text. The way you get these featured images into your page or into the home, your front page, if you go to the page you're using, that one's services, I'm going to edit that page and it's the featured image. This image here is the one that will appear on the front page. So if we go back to the front page, there we go, that's the, that's the featured uh, image and you set all the other boxes up in the same way but the settings are slightly different so I've, I've made you a screenshot here um, these are the settings for home middle settings for home bottom and for home bottom left and right and these are the settings in a bit more easy to read format home top home middle home bottom left and right so stop the video at that point and you can read through and see just what you need settings to be. If you put something in this, this area here, it's the home top widget area, that's the home middle widget area, that's the home bottom left and right. You can add more things into that home middle widget area. You could add the same widget two or three times and just set it to be different pages if you want to. So you could have several different pages stacking on top of each other. Um, a bit more details there if you want to read through, we stop the video and read through. And even more details. Anyway, back to the beginning. So basically that's what you want to do. To add these boxes to your front page, you go to Dashboard, Appearance, Widgets, and then look for Home Top, Home Middle, Home Bottom, Left and Right. Then you drag, <coughs> pardon me, you drag into these, into home top, 
Genesis featured page widget, uh, widget into that widget area there and just configure it as we've seen. Oh, thanks for watching and bye for now.